is at startup pressures. T minus 15 seconds. Falcon 9A is configured for flight. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Mission lift off. As you just saw, Falcon 9 has successfully cleared the pad and is now on its ascent with the test spacecraft in its fairing. Now coming up in about 15 minutes, you're gonna hear the call out that Falcon 9 will have hit max Q. That stands for maximum aerodynamic pressure. That is the point at which the rocket is seeing its highest stresses on its ascent. Vehicle has passed maximum aerodynamic pressure. You can tell by the cheers and what you heard on that call out, we have gotten through max Q. Coming up next, you're going to hear uh, the call for MVAC engine chill. Engine chill has begun. And that was it. That is where we chill in that Merlin vacuum engine down to operating temperature. Now coming up here shortly, you're going to hear three big events happening in rapid succession. The first is MECO, that stands for main engine cutoff. That is where all nine of the first stage engines are going to shut down. That's in preparation for the next step, which is stage step or stage separation. There's where stage one will separate from stage two. Stage one will make its way back down to the drone ship. Stage two will continue on with tests to its orbit. And then you're going to hear second engine start. That is the ignition of the second stage engine. Let's check it out here. Miko. Stage separation confirmed. Stage one is under the split. And recognition. All right. And as you just saw, we had a successful stage separation and a successful ignition of that second stage engine. Now the fairing should be deploying at any moment. There we go. And you can see that tiny but strong test spacecraft inside of that or on top of stage two. Now stage one is making its way back down to Earth. What we're going to see coming up pretty shortly is a boost back burn. Grid fins deployed. Grid fins have deployed. Both stages following nominal trajectories. Acquisition of signal, Bermuda. Right now, stage two is going to continue to burn until T plus eight minutes and 20 seconds, while stage one makes its way back down to Earth.